Hello Capricorn and welcome to your reading for the week ahead of October 23rd. Well, you have a way with words um, that like attracts the attention of others. Your words are very powerful, especially like with writing, you know, so your thoughts can just flow on paper. That's what I'm seeing there. You know, there's radiant energy to like your already pretty full friendship um, friendships. Um, and it's going to make like your friendships or, you know, your relations with others like friends and that begin to feel like deeper relationships. OK, more bonding feeling deeper meanings in some of them. You may find your intuition more surprisingly accurate than reason, um, but it's like night and day. So you may have those sparks, but then it's like a switch. This could even happen in a day where the psychic energy shifts back to like logic and forethought. So it's like, some of your intuition may surprise you this week, but then it's like you go back to logical thinking. That's the energy I'm seeing there. Um, you know, with the uh, home, work, it's like everything you need is like pretty good there. So... Conversations are positive and very beneficial to you, um, you know, with things that you need. And it makes like work, home, conversations and things very beneficial to you. It's looking good. Whatever was going on with maybe a friend or a group project, it allows you to shine and expand. An, oppor an opportunity can bring a dream closer, okay? So that is really looking good there. I like that. Oops, I hit the phone. Okay, let's see what's here. Mm. A business alliance... For some of you, presents like maybe problems. If it involves, because I see some jealousy here or envy. Okay, so be careful about um, a business partner or someone that you work with. But fortunately, the right words from the right person fix everything. And you are really good with words this week. So it looks like it's being able to diffuse that energy. You know, you're ready for pretty much like maybe towards the end of the week, like the weekend, I feel this is, but time is different for everyone, which may, you know, include some errands as well as a little bit of pleasure here, mixed energy here. Um, also watch your spending. It's like, you know, an example, you go out for dinner and it's all great and good and then the bill comes, okay? So that kind of energy is showing up, all right? Now, you may start off on the wrong foot with like a loved one or a friend, and but it will take a surprising um, happy turn and resolve things, okay? So things get resolved really quick there too. So that's what I'm seeing there too. Yeah, you definitely think with words and can be like maybe writing more or your thoughts just pour easily in writing. Also, your feelings, okay? It's like expressing your feelings through writing. So if you are a writer or you want to start writing, it really looks really good here. Um, it's very accurate, um, you know, being clear and articulate. 
Now, there can be someone that's like a little bit attached to your hip type of <laughs> energy, like needy, clingy. They seem to be going through some issues or <sighs> some anxiety, and it can exhaust you. So just be careful of that energy a little too, okay? Otherwise, you got pretty much strong energy. I do like that. The letter T can be important for some. I do see a horseshoe, but there is some, something about it. For some, don't push your luck. Just say, I'm going to give you an example. You're in a casino and you keep winning, 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 and you're winning pretty good. Cut, your, um, cut it quick because you may just go and lose it. Your luck can turn. So that's just an example. I'm not saying you're going to be in a casino. I'm giving you examples of what I'm seeing. But you got some luck, okay? You got some... Um, Successes coming in too, and opportunities. You got pretty good energy. I have to say that. Also, travel could be, or a move is definitely showing up for some, or it's heavy on the mind. Okay, let's see the plate. All right, on the plate. Yeah, I do see a lot of demands for your attention. Um, it's good. I mean, there it's some good people around you, but it's like you're in demand for attention. Um, yeah, just very demanding, all right, um, energy. So it's like you could be popular, people wanting your attention, demanding your attention, okay? So we are seeing that energy. Um, again, you may be cutting. It's like you're editing, dicing, slicing, editing some things out, okay? These could be some thoughts that you had or even ideas where now you're like um, categor categorizing. I'm like, oh, this is just um, stress. This is um, stupid thoughts. You know, I shouldn't have thought of that. Or you're just adjusting some things too, okay? You're finding ways to be ahead of the competition too for some of what I'm seeing here. Um, some situations, some people, whatever is not good. It's like you could be eliminating or they're just leaving anyway. That's good for you. Um there is that, you know, you're taking things a little bit more with the flow. I like that energy. There's a new, like, beginning in a way for some where it's an unknown territory. You're starting over. Just say uh, you moved somewhere to a new country, new state or something. I'm giving you an example. It's all brand new. It's like you're just starting all over. Um, it's not really, yeah, it's starting all over, but then there's that energy like it's just the, un the unknown, okay? It's like a new clean slate, you have manifesting energy, so really it's like, you know, like the magician card. You, you're you the magician, so you can create um, a lot, uh, manifest what you can't, you know, what you want. Um, there is, for some, you know, we're dealing, you're going to be dealing with some property matters, um, real estate, possibly. Um, there could be bonuses coming in, raise promotion, you know, it depends. It's um, general, when we do general readings. I'm just going to pull out what it can basically mean. Okay, so we are say, seeing that too, that energy. So, well, looks pretty good to me. Well, anyway, um, Capricorn, that was your reading for the week ahead of um, October 23rd. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.